hey before I start the video I just want to let you guys know that you guys should be subscribing and turning on those notifications because if you guys show up early to my video you guys will 100% get your comments hearted and replied to so if you guys have anything you guys want to ask me or anything you guys even want to say to me come early to my videos so you guys will 100% get your comments read and replied to and I can give you my opinion on anything you got to say or ask and yeah hey yo what is going on guys welcome back to another video here and in today's video we are back on wisteria bringing you guys another banger showcase video and as you guys can see right beside me we have a hybrid demon and this one right here is going to be the water breathing hybrid so we're going to be showcasing all of the moves from beginning to end and then we're going to go ahead and take a look at um the skills in a 1v1 type battle and we're going to use with slayer mark and without slayer mark to see how strong and how much potential these hybrids actually do have so hopefully you guys make it all the way to the end of the video and hope you guys enjoy all right guys we're gonna go ahead and get straight on with this showcase starting off with the water breather first so he's gonna go ahead and use his first skill for us which is called water surface slash go ahead and showcase it for us real quick just don't hit us with it just yet so as you guys can see his water actually turns red which is pretty cool kind of reminds me of blood not gonna lie but use it one more time if you can I'm pretty sure it has a short cooldown so we can go ahead and use it one more time it looks super dope I'm totally enjoying these new hybrids I'm kind of jealous not gonna lie I kind of wish I could be a hybrid but sadly I can't and go ahead and use that skill on us real quick to test out that damage see if he gets a damage buff or not looks about the same damage guys but it does look a lot cooler I'm really enjoying that red water kind of reminds me of blood let me know if you guys agree with that but let's go ahead and move on to the second skill all right guys now moving on to the second water ability we have water wheel so go ahead and showcase that skill for us real quick as you guys can see i think honestly i think water wheel is has to be the coolest one because I, i'm a big fan of the water wheel go ahead and use it one more time and it just looks amazing in red like for some reason water wheel in red just looks 10 million times better than the original um the original blue one Oh, yeah, hybrids also burn in the sun. Let's move down this way because the, the shade's moving up that way. And go ahead and actually use that skill on us real quick. We're going to stand right in front of you. Just see what it looks like. Oh, my gosh. I can't, I can't even express how cool that looks, guys. The red on the water wheel just looks so amazing. But let's go ahead and move on to that third ability. All right, guys, so now we're going to go ahead and move on to the third skill for water breathing, which is going to be flowing dance, guys. Go ahead and use that skill for us so we can take a look at that real quick. As you guys can see, pretty much every single skill that water breathing has, once you're a hybrid, it looks 10 million times cooler. 10 billion exact. That's the exact number scientifically proven. 10 million times cooler, guys. Go ahead and use that one more time, but not on us. I think it should be off cooldown. Maybe it's still on cooldown because these last two moves do actually have a longer cooldown. So we're going to have to wait just a quick second for him to get that move back up. And he's going to go ahead and use that skill on us once that cooldown's up. So we're just going to wait for that cooldown. It should be any second now. Oh, there we go. Oh. All right, guys, he accidentally went ahead and used the wrong move on us right there, but he's going to go ahead and hit us with that flowing dance right now. So go ahead and use that skill on us. As you guys can see, I think this skill is obviously the most overpowered out of the skill set. Um, I really do enjoy that move. As you guys watched my other video where I did water versus wind, um, I did play on a water account, so I can kind of relate. And that skill right there has to be my favorite alongside with the water wheel. And now let's go ahead and move on to the fourth and final skill for water breathing. And then we'll go ahead and look at his secret combo. All right, guys, now we're going to go ahead and move on to the last and final water breathing skill, which is called constant flux. And this one looks very cool as well. So go ahead and showcase that move for us real quick. I'm just going to stand back because I know it has a lot of travel with it. And as you guys can see at the end, even the dragon head turns red, guys, which is super cool. I don't know how cool you guys think that is, but for me, that looks very cool because I'm a big fan of water breathing, especially from the anime and stuff. So let's go ahead and have him use that on us. Um, just 
you know get your get your proper distance because i know sometimes constant flux can be hard to hit so just you know distance yourself as much as you need but as you guys can see he went ahead and hit us with that skill looks pretty cool guys and that's gonna wrap it up for water we're just gonna go ahead and look at his combo after this and let me know what you guys think of this water breathing hybrid in the comment section down below all right guys so now we're gonna go ahead and move on to his combo so let's go ahead and see what his combo is looking like um he's gonna go ahead and pop his slayer mark and go ahead and hit us with that combo real quick As you guys can see, we were literally executed in the in the, in this time span of three moves. Um, that is pretty OP, especially with the Slayer Mark on, and they get the Demon Regen as well, but without Max Muzon's blood. So they have normal passive Demon Regen, which is pretty good. And yeah, that's pretty much his combo. So let's go ahead and move into those one v ones. All right, guys. Now we're gonna go ahead and one v one the Hybrid Water Breather without Slayer Mark. So let's go ahead and get this started. Three, two, one, go. Alright guys, now we're going to go ahead and move into the Slayer Mark 1v1 against the Water Style Hybrid user. So let's go ahead and start this 1v1. 3, 2, 1, go.
thank you guys so much for making it to the end of the video if you guys did enjoy this video i would appreciate it if you guys could leave a like and also subscribe guys because those 1v1s were super intense and fun and let me know what you guys think of those hybrids in the comment section down below are they even still worth it do you guys even still want to go that or you know are you guys planning on you know just staying a slayer and it's not worth your time but in my opinion i think it's super cool i think that you guys should go out and get it because they look super cool as well as you get that demon regen which is super op so what are you guys waiting for go over and get yourself that hybrid because you do get to keep that slayer mark as well which makes it super op anyways guys hope you guys enjoyed this video and peace out hopefully i'll be seeing you guys in the next one